Yeah. He has taken the multimeter which measures voltage, current, resistance and the continuity. He's now working on the MLC there. He's checking if we can have a, a problem with our power supply to the collimeter. And also miniature circuit breakers found on that power supply. He's now through with that one, it's okay. Now he is headed to the modulator power supply section. This is where all the power to the machine emanates from. You can see we have circuit breakers there. He's confirming if the three phase power supply is okay. Fine. Eh? Yes. Let's chase Martin and find out what the next step is going to do. That is our toolbox. This is a machine which we use to hoist heavy loads. He is now directly add the RF generator the Clistron and the water circulation section too is confirming if the pressure is okay PSI units is okay yes up there he's going to the uh, section for hexafluoride gas to check if the hexafluoride gas pressure is also okay. The farming is okay there. Yeah, 32. Yeah. yeah. That is the cylinder for the gas. Yeah. After that, it is checking on the bed magnet circuit section and also the PWM. With this front foliage and pen market foliage they are also okay. Water. Water pressure is okay. Yeah. Okay. About 40. Yeah. Okay, that's all. Maybe the you coach? Know, uh, the coach? Is the uh, coach moving up or down or uh, vertically? That is. Yeah. It's confirming using the pendant, hand pendant. Those are the stars, as you can see them. That is our step down power supply from 240 to 110. Laser lights. Okay, it seems the coach is not moving. We have a hardware fault. The hardware fault is is overridden, so so it can't move. What about the country? Okay. Thanks for today.